Well, today I'm going to make a short video on locating where all the relays and slow relays and other electrical equipment are on a bigger excavator. So I had problems with my track speed on the big excavator. It would not go into high speed. So I had to do some digging around and I found out where a lot of the electrical components are, such as the relays. And they're in a very peculiar spot on that Volvo. So this is the relay that I took off and tested it and it's all good. So I'm gonna put it on today and show you where all these relays and other electrical stuff are located. And it's not behind the seat. I've got the relay and my socket set. Let's get after it. There it is, the Volvo 290 parked in the trees. Don't have enough room in the shop with all the other stuff I have. So it has to sit out here and things just break while it sits. So hopefully I'll be able to get rid of the scissor lift and move this thing into the shop. At the front of the machine on this Volvo, you'll have the battery compartment right here and then Right behind it, there's this cover that's on the fuel tank, it has these four bolts, and that's where all these relays and other electrical stuff are located. I'll take that off and show you. just a fiberglass cover it makes it look like it's steel but it isn't it's really light to pull off so here you can see there's another cover in here with a bunch of wires going up inside and this is all sealed cover with a big like rubber o-ring I'm going to take that off to get access to the electrical components. And there are all your relays and other electrical things that I'm not sure what they are, but here's a little key that's on the door It has all your relays and symbols of what they do and what they operate. All right, let's put that relay back on. Here it is, it goes like that. I should plug in just like that. Right. Bolt. Before we put the cover back on, I'm going to lube up these or clean these rubber gaskets. I just have some WD here handy, and I'm sure other type of more thicker lubricants are probably better. Lube her up. This helps it seal again, nice and tight, so you don't get water in here and damage all your electrical components.
All right, there you go. It's all back put together. And just for the future, if you blow something and you can't find the fuse behind the cab, make sure to look out here above the battery and even in the battery compartment. All right, thanks for watching.